This crystal cave is extremely dangerous. It's almost impossible to breathe here. In this video, I will show you why. The crystal cave is located in Mexico, about 300 meters underground. Inside the cave you will find massive crystals, some as long as a bus. The crystals were submerged in mineral rich water at very high temperatures for thousands of years, which caused them to grow to these giant crystals. Watch till the end to find out how it's possible for crystals to grow. But first, why is it dangerous? This is because it's almost impossible to breathe here due to two factors. The humidity in the cave is close to 100%. The air is saturated with water vapor, making it feel very thick. You will have an extremely hard time breathing here. The second factor is hot temperature. The temperature in the cave can go up to 58 degrees Celsius. In such high heat, the body struggles to regulate its internal temperature, which can be very dangerous to your body. So where does heat come from? The crystal cave in Mexico is really hot because it's close to underground lava. Lava is melted rock from deep inside the earth and is very very hot. Also, the cave is deep underground, where the earth's heat gets trapped. This makes the air inside the cave very warm and wet. And because of all this heat, the cave has grown some of the biggest crystals in the world. But it's too hot for people to stay in there for long. How are crystals made? The heat allowed a large amount of minerals to dissolve in the water. And in fact, the water contained more minerals than it could hold at that temperature. Over thousands of years these minerals slowly came out of the water and turned into crystals. Because the cave was really hot and stayed at the same temperature for a very long time, it allowed the minerals to solidify into crystals. And after the crystals are formed, they can continue to grow as long as the conditions are right and the water is still oversaturated with minerals. Nowadays, these crystals are some of the largest ever seen. Thanks for watching, and if you like videos like these, here are two other videos that you may find interesting as well. See you next time!